The common idea of stellar nurseries claims that stars are born into existence as nebulous areas of space contract, forming a dense ball of gas. Now, it sounds like a plausible explanation for the origin of stars in the universe. However, one big problem with this theory is that while we have seen stars destroyed when they go supernova, we've never observed a star form. Every example of supposed star formation is a case where a cloudy or a nebulous area of space starts to clear and we spot a star for the first time. No star was formed, it simply became visible. It's like driving down the road in a dense fog and suddenly the fog lifts and you see this massive mountain ahead. Now the mountain didn't magically form in the last few minutes, it was just revealed when the fog dissipated. The God of the Bible created the stars of heaven on the fourth day, and we read in Psalms that He knows each one of them by name. I'm David Reeves. Truly, the heavens declare the glory of God. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube videos by clicking the button below. Every week we bring you brand new content relating to science and the Bible. We'll see you next week. I'm David Reeves. Truly, the heavens declare the glory of God.